What are the major differences between elementary and secondary RTI? For years we've concentrated on younger children and understandably so. Uh, let's find out uh, those who are having difficulties, let's concentrate on those and let's really try to get them off on a good path. Because of that emphasis uh, we've somewhat ignored what has been going on with older children and the needs of, of students in middle school and high school are very unique and we while we can take some things that we've learned with younger kids and apply it uh, in middle school and, and high school there's many uh, things that we need to do differently first and foremost the kids are different as learners developmentally uh, they've moved into a different uh, phase uh, and secondly, and of equal importance, is the fact that the demands of the curriculum are markedly different. And so students may be performing well as third graders, fourth graders, and we may think, hey, they're on the right path. But when they encounter the elevated curriculum demands in middle school and high school, then they're they're called upon to evidence different skills and different strategies and if they don't have these then they can run into difficulties. So it's both developmentally students are different and the demands of the curriculum are markedly different and so we're looking at uh, coming up with different kinds of strategies and solutions to meet their needs.